Hi, Branton. It's Katrina Barry from uh, the Track Axe team here. I was curious when we got your uh, forum post whether there was a solution to your problem. This is a bit of a quick and dirty fix. It's probably not exactly what you're after, but it um, it may suffice for the time being. So I just downloaded a clip here um, of a car. I was just going to see if I was able to somehow um, blur its number plate. So I'll just play the video here for you to see. Okay, so there's the video. So what I've done here, I'll just show you my solution. I'll just uh, unmute this video track and play back what I've done to um, blur the number plate. Okay. So what I did was in an application like Microsoft Paint or Fireworks or any really graphic editing uh, application, I just created a rectangle. So I'll just pull up my media browser here and I'll just preview this just to show you. So as you can see, I just created this little white rectangle and then I brought it into the mixing screen. And then all along the video, I just resize the rectangle to cover the area that the number plate's in. So if I just pull up the segment properties there, you can see here if I just, I'll just get my mixing, my play bar there. So if I just pull up the uh, segment properties. I can then place the rectangle over the number plate. Obviously some programs would have sophisticated motion tracking software that you could place one point and then the other but that's not really the aim of what we were trying to do with track XPC so this is just really an interim fix that you could perhaps use. So I really just went through the video and just placed the rectangle everywhere that was required to cover the number plate. So it's actually pretty straightforward and um, probably the only complicated part was when we have the uh, car turning a corner. So obviously there, I had to take the rectangle and rotate it slightly to cover the uh, the number plate. So it's just an idea that um, of something you could do to solve the problem that you're experiencing. Thanks a million.